What is a SWOT analysis and why do you need to do one? Hi, my name is Robin Addis. I am the Chief Operating Officer and Chief Marketing and Business Development Officer at Legal Internet Solutions Incorporated, a digital agency that specializes in law firms and legal services providers. Today, I want to talk to you about a SWOT analysis. So what is a SWOT analysis? Why do you need to do one? How do you get started? What questions do you ask yourself? And most importantly, what can you do with this information? A SWOT analysis is a technique for assessing the strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats facing your firm. You need to conduct a SWOT analysis on a regular basis to help analyze what your firm does best right now and create a roadmap for strategic success in the future. When you're doing your SWOT analysis, you're going to be thinking of internal and external factors. Internally, you're going to be looking at your strengths and your weaknesses. Externally, you're going to be looking at your opportunities and your threats. In terms of strengths, there are a number of questions you're going to want to ask yourself, starting with, what do you do well? What resources do you have, whether that be a technology or a system or a process that you have in place? Or your talent pool. What does that talent pool look like? Do you have a range of diverse perspectives and differences of thought and opinion? Are you bringing a multi-generational approach into the conversation? What diverse perspectives can you bring to bear? And how are you perceived as being strong? When it comes to weaknesses, you're going to want to ask yourself, what do you not do well? And while this is difficult, you really have to be honest with yourself here. What resources are you lacking? For example, are you still using a paper process for your client intake or taking notes from your call log on an Excel spreadsheet? That feels like a good time to rethink that process. What issues do you have with communication? This is a big one for clients because this is another hard thing to really critically look at with a fresh perspective. But if you're having communication challenges, those are the first ones that you're going to want to fix. And how are you perceived as weak? With opportunities, you wanna think about where could you improve? And you can think about that in the context of what trends do you see on the horizon? Have your clients asked you for a service or support in some way that you're not currently offering to them? And could that service be added as one from your firm? What network can you tap into? And what information do you maybe know that others don't? With threats, think about what leaks you have. Where are you losing revenue because you don't have a process button down? How are you potentially hurting loyalty? And that could be internally or externally in terms of client satisfaction or employee retention and morale. How is your competition doing? What are they doing? And what threats do your weaknesses expose you to? Once you get all of this written down, you're gonna wanna take a critical look at the information you put in each box of your SWOT analysis and think about how can you create a smart, plan for addressing each of these issues. And when I say smart, I mean specific, measurable, attainable, realistic, and time-based. You're going to want to create very specific goals at various timelines over the next period, whether that's month, six months, year, so that you can come back and measure your success against your plan and understand what your actions did to impact your strategic plan. And then do this whole process again. You're going to see that some things haven't changed, some things have gotten significantly better, but maybe some things have gotten worse and need to go up higher on your priority list. Whatever you do, if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to me. You can email me, robin at legalisi.com, or feel free to reach out to me on LinkedIn. Connect with me at linkedin.com slash in slash Robin Thanks so much and have a great day.